Made in Hollywood. Diane Lane and Kevin Costner star as husband and wife on a journey to save their grandson from a dangerous family in the dramatic thriller, Let Him Go. Hi, I'm Diane Lane, and here's a scene from Let Him Go. You're going with me or without me? What was very interesting to me was the very few words between Margaret and George. When you read the script, was that interesting to you? There, there used to be a, a joke, I would say, uh, if you want to get nominated, play a mute. <laughs> because it invites the audience in to fill in the blanks. Instead of being told, you lean in and you, you're saying, oh, what's happening here? I loved how, how simple the story was. But then I loved the opportunity to paint a portrait of a marriage between Kevin and Diane. I saw exactly what I've always felt about Donnie Weeboy. And I saw that girl can't protect her child. Margaret Jimmy's her boy. He's your grandson. Kevin Costner and Diane Lane, no brainer. Um, and then talking with Tom Bazooka, the director, who I didn't know and I hadn't worked with, and I could tell that creatively, artistically, we were on the same page. The thing that was fascinating to me was how the Margaret and Blanche characters, uh, Diane and Leslie, were sort of the same person, just the opposite sides of the same coin. We came to see our grandson. My boy doesn't have to answer to you. And we don't have to answer to you. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> You have three mothers, different different versions of how to mother, and uh, you know the wonderful Leslie Manville. She's such a formidable actress. It's playing those kind of women that are really not like me that gets me up in the morning. That's my thing to play people that are a long way from me. There's a threat underneath. She's. It seems all friendly ish, and it becomes a, a war of wills between all of them. Come with us. No. He'd kill me. Him and his mother. It certainly becomes a, a thriller and a bit of, a, of an action film, uh, which is sort of surprising to be sandwiched in the middle of a different sort of film. It was a chase and a rescue, um, that that had a simple thriller part. Your grandson. He's a wee boy now. If you have blood in peril, I don't know how you don't go as far as you can. You don't realize what's coming, the way it gently and beautifully unfolds. Don't start what you can't finish. <laughs>